want to find so remarkable about you, your spirit. The, 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 something I saw yesterday about uh, cerebral palsy happening for a number of reasons, most of which are actually quite common. Like, uh, for, for example, ge uh, neonatal jaundice, for example. I gave, well, both my babies had them when I, when I gave birth to them. So, just thinking that something as simple as that, something as, you know, uh, people, children get neonatal jaundice all the time, they are put in the food therapy machine, they're fine. So thinking that something as simple as that, thinking that, that I don't know, it's just, it just feels like it will happen to anyone. Labor, which happens to a lot of women, it could happen to anyone. How did it happen to you? So what happened is the reason why, why I got the neonatal jaundice in the first place was because of the misses incompatibility of my parents. parents. But my father was was a positive and my mom is, is all negative. So what happened was my, my older sister also got jaundice, but 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 they put her, her in the hospital and she was fine. But when I was born, I was born with a blocked intestine. So I had to be operated the one I was two, two days old. And I had to be in the incubator for six weeks. So all the other journeys couldn't be cheap. Couldn't be in a therapy machine. Yeah. Until, until after the, the period. And it was too late. It was too late. And, and, and of course, nobody knew that it had happened. Until, uh, until I had grown up a little and I wasn't meeting the milestone, so my mom took me to, to a specialist in, in the UK to take it and brain scan and they said the brain was damaged. You have a sister. Yeah. What, growing up, were you treated any different from her? Were you given the same chores? Were you made to do the same thing? Did you talk about boys like every other? Yeah. 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 They yeah. made you feel normal. Yeah. And I think that's very important for people with It is, it is, it is. I always say that, I mean, we are not, we are not treated any differently. I wasn't given any professional treatment. You still when, wash dishes? When, still when, this when, stuff. when I was not here, I was teaching like my sister. <laughs> we used to fight. I mean, we used to have fights and all that stuff. And that, that my mom would be like, like okay, you, you guys just kill, 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 kill each other. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, you know that there's anything wrong with, and that is what you're looking for to forget about your yeah. disability and be able to go on as a normal yeah. person like everyone else. What what is the the the, the, the I keep uh, what, the what I keep getting from you is that you're someone who doesn't give up. You're someone who just goes for what you want. What makes you what makes you decide not to give up? What makes you decide that you need to push forward? Is it about being an inspiration for other people, or is this just about a personal journey that you're on? Honestly, when more people say that I, I am I am an inspiration, I still don't get it because as far as far as I'm concerned, I'm just living my life the best way I can with, with the resources that I have. And so after that, when people say I'm an, an inspiration, I don't know how to respond yes, because I think that I'm trying to talk to you. That's because, because, that's because you, are, you, are, you are not from the outside looking in. Okay. But for okay. some of us, we know how difficult it is for people who are quote unquote normal to be able to. For example, you are also a woman, okay? Which, although is not a problem at all, sometimes can be. Especially when you are in a school setting, in a working environment, especially in a male dominated field like yours. So, you not only have to um, um, deal with. Uh, uh, your limitations, then you have to deal with being a woman, then you have to deal with being young, then you have to deal with being a young woman in a very difficult and male dominated you know, um, profession. Mm -hmm. How do you just deal with all that? I, I remember t telling, telling somebody that, that if I were in, in a college in UK or US and, and you have those, those minority boxes on. I'll check I, I, I'm the minority. Yeah, everything. <laughs> everything. But, but for me, I thrive on challenges. When, when I'm not challenged, I get bored. If, if my job doesn't challenge me anymore, I leave. You I need get, to change uh, jobs. Get something. 
So all these things are challenges that, that have made me what, what I am. Because when, when I see a challenge, I want to surmount it. I want to prove to myself that yes, I can also do it. So that is how maybe that is what, what has has made me the, the way I am. But yeah, so that is. I think I think that the reason why we all think you're an, an inspiration is that we need to put people who have been able to get past their limitations, put them on a pedestal somewhere and throw children who are feeling, not everybody has your kind of spirit, trust me. I always say not everyone has social shock absorbers. Some people have, have strong natural shock absorbers than others. You are able to take it. You make yourself feel normal. And for that reason, if anybody thinks you're not normal, that is not acceptable to you. Yeah. There are people, unfortunately, who you know, yeah, yeah. I do not have a seat. Yeah, yeah, and that is why I come for shows like that. Because I'm a very public person. I don't like like publicity or anything. But then I realize that to whom much much is given, much is much expected. Much is expected. So I come on shows like this. So, so, so maybe a mother or father of a child or something will see me and say that okay, maybe if I if I pump energy and, and whatever and, and he's starting into this shot maybe he or she will become the Parita or become even better than Parita We must not forget that there are people but, yes. who are not in that position Yes, I'm actually part of an, of an organization called Shake and we, have, we actually have a rehab center in, in Osualata Okay for for the community, because we did that small area, there are a lot of children who okay. so we So we, we, we have to get our kids to come there and shoot the children for free and all that stuff. So that is what we, what we do to give back to the community. But the problem is that beyond the financial concern, most of the parents are not willing to do what needs to be done to help their children because they're giving up. They have given up. Have given I think up. that is that, that is the, so, the, the general situation. Because although they may not be able to make it, to buy the the working aid or whatever, they can even make a makeshift. Sure. Like I saw a picture of you somewhere. Was it was it you? You had this wooden um, <laughs> makeshift yeah. walking. Yeah, aid. yes, yes, and and we, and, and we are actually training some of the mothers on how to make oh, no, of, of these them. of this working aid. So it is the interest that that, that, that has to go along with because I mean I've seen so many children who are even better off than me. But because they were not given the, the amount of therapy and, and all that 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 they needed to be given, they are they, they're seeing what we saw. And 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 it pains me because you don't know what what a child is capable it's of going to be. And and that you actually so, so, and, uh, uh, most of the time, they are not the intelligence. They are not the intelligence. In fact, when, the, when my mom took me for the for the brain scan at the age of one, they told her that 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 it, 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 it damaged the um, the the cerebellum, brain, which, which, which is the part of the brain that that manages the movement. Okay. Uh, it is not a third intelligence. In fact, the intelligence may, may even be higher than normal. Okay. Yeah. So, so, so actually, uh, there might be a positive to it. Yeah. So, but but because people focus so much on the negative, we are not able to see to to get the children to be able to communicate what they are able to do. And let's say the 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 our 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 welfare system is practically non-existent. No. So there's no help for the. For parents to see, children with disabilities, so that they be more for them. I mean, if you have a child with a disability right now, where do you start from? Where do you start from? I mean, who do you go and see? It's very the pe the thing that people don't understand about um, about as you said, you have work to do, but you do take your time. You are a private person, and you do take the time to still go on interviews just to educate people. Mm -hmm. I think is the education that is lacking. Somewhere, somewhere in, in the village, somewhere or somewhere, there's a mother sitting there wondering what to do with her child who has a disability, not knowing where to go. I recently met a mother, she needed 550 just to buy the 
walking aid that the, physici- the therapist needed to. I think the physiotherapist needed a, a, a bunch of things to be able to start therapy, and I think he was doing it pro bono, but they still couldn't find the amount to buy the the, the aids. And for apparently, he says for about six months, he told them to go find the money and come back. But he hasn't heard from them. So then we had to call her, you know, speak to her. She agreed she was going to bring the boy for, for therapy, and then we took it. But the point is, I think it's the giving up part. It's the giving up part that seems to be the problem with parents. Do you know that the number of times that I've heard about children with cerebral palsy being loved by the by is being loved in the bush to to, 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 to die, to die. Uh, because because they believe that 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 they are back to so they should be loved by the child to die. So they they don't continue. To die. Still have yes. us, yeah. There's also our our tendency to, to attach spirituality to everything. Oh yes. They look yes. different. God didn't want them to look no more. So they look like this. Let's do this to them. And let's do that to them. There are times when you actually take such children children and you, you probably rehabilitate them, etc. And taking them back to the community, the community wouldn't even accept them. Oh yeah. Because they believe that. That's how it's by